The City of Somerville has recently passed a set of ordinances which allow and encourage residents to keep bees and chickens for both home food production and economic development. These ordinances are part of a wider urban agriculture initiative in the city that aims to support existing urban agriculture activities. This video is to provide some information for residents specifically wanting to keep chickens. Did you know? Hens only lay eggs for approximately three to five years, but they can live up to ten years. If you order chicks online, it's difficult to be sure that they are all hens and not roosters. Roosters are not allowed in Somerville. The rules. If you choose to sell your eggs, the state requires that the eggs you sell be stored and maintained at 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Since you are responsible for the chickens, you must live at the residence where you are keeping them. If you are a tenant, you will need written permission from the property owner. Chicken waste must be composted with materials such as a hay bedding or leaves in a rodent-proof composter, or it must be stored in a sealed container until it is removed from the property. Hen feed must be stored in a rodent-proof container inside your home, not outside. Noise from hens at the property boundary must conform to the city's noise ordinance. Odors from hens, hen manure, or other hen-related substances shall not be noticeable at the property boundaries. Hens and hen houses are not permitted in front yards or in side yards that abut streets. Structures need to meet all building code requirements. An enclosed hen house needs to provide at least two square feet per chicken of space. An enclosed pen needs to provide at least four square feet of permeable surface per chicken. Hen houses must be located in a well-drained area that does not discharge to a public way or to a neighbor's property. All outdoor roaming areas for chickens need to be enclosed and screened from the street and neighboring properties. One of my main um, points of, of advocacy is to really be proactive with your neighbors. Um, when I started keeping my chickens, I spoke with all of my neighbors. I gave them links and information. I gave them a, a little schematic of what, I, uh, what my coop was going to look like, how many birds I was planning on having, um, promises for eggs, which are always a good bartering tool. Uh, and I had a really, really excellent response. Um, and all my neighbors love my birds, and now half the neighborhood comes over to say hi to them whether I'm home or not half the time. Recommendations. Because hens are social creatures, it is not recommended that you keep only one. Before getting hens, think through where and how you will keep them, including what to do when they stop laying eggs, die, or if you get a rooster by mistake. Chicken waste is an excellent fertilizer, but it must be composted first. Keep your coops clean and put waste in a rodent-proof composter. If a coop attracts rodents, it can be shut down. Connect with other chicken keepers to find out the best ways to keep healthy hens. This information and more is summarized in a helpful document called the ABCs of Urban Agriculture. For this document and the complete Urban Agriculture Zoning Ordinance, as well as the Board of Health Rules, please visit the City of Somerville's website. Okay.